What is going on guys? Injustice from Operation KOD here bringing you another Funko Mystery Box unboxing. This time we have two Mystery Boxes from Fugitive Toys. It was their $10 Friday Grail Hunt and the four grails that you were able to get in this box was the San Diego Comic Con exclusive Indiana Jones. The San Diego Comic-Con exclusive Metallic Wiss. The San Diego Comic-Con exclusive Metallic Animal. And Hulk Hogan Yellow Shirt. The original Hulk Hogan Pop. Now, there is no commons in these boxes from what the post says. There is Chase, Vaulted, or Exclusives only. And we got two. I and myself got one, and the lady that's always behind the camera has gotten the second one. So we're going to see whose box did better in this video. Like always, we have Pop Price Guide pulled up in the background to see who pulled the best pull of this box. So, let's see. Who pulled the best one? They come like this. So I'm gonna take it out of the box. Feels like it's in a pop protector, so I don't know if that's a good thing or not. I'm trying to feel to see which one sides the back. What's the front? That's the back. Okay. Now I believe this is my box. So, ready? Three, two. <laughs> I think I literally, in the last video, just freaking pulled this. Same exact pop, but that one's Goku and this one's Vegeta. Once again, I do not collect anime pops so oh i forgot to say any of these pops in this video in these mystery boxes that you would possibly like that i specify that i'm not keeping will be on my poshmark it's an app where you can buy sell all that kind of stuff i will have the link for that in the description Come see my prices. If you don't like them, shoot me an offer. Who knows? I might accept it. But this, this pop probably will be on my Poshmark. It's the 2020 Emerald City Comic Con exclusive. I'm going to take it out of the pop protector so it doesn't have a glare on it. There we go. That's better. I think 2020 convention exclusive Vegeta. Eating noodles. Let's see. G E T A. Dang it. E A T I N G. Vegeta eating noodles goes for 26 bucks. So we're $16 profit here from the box. But we paid 10 bucks. No, it was like 15 for shipping. So far, we're off to a bad, bad start. At least we're gonna pop protector out of it. I also, on my Poshmark, have mystery box. I myself am doing mystery boxes. I have a whole collection of just random pops in boxes. There are the mystery boxes themselves right there. There's 10 boxes altogether. I have no idea what is in them. The lady behind the camera is the one that pulled them out, put them in the boxes. I have no idea the value. I have no idea anything. So you pick the number, comment down below in my Poshmark. You pick the number, I ship it to you. I have no idea what's in them. I had some good ones. I had like some convention exclusives and a couple other pretty cool pops. And I think I put, I have the, I have it up for like 12 bucks. 
12 bucks. I think there's like $7 shipping. So it'll come out to like 19 bucks. You can get a decent pool. Okay. The second one. Once again, pull it out of the packaging. It is in a pot protector again. Okay, so that's the bottom. I can't tell which is the back. Okay, so that's the back. Here's the front, I think, I hope. Okay, ready? In three, two, oh my god. I think I wanna give up on mystery boxes, guys. We got the 2020 Emerald City Comic Con Piccolo from freaking Dragon Ball Z. I do not collect Dragon Ball Z pop. So if you want this pop, this will be in my Poshmark. Link below to check it out. Buy some pops. They take PayPal. I mean, it's th two to three day shipping. Even. Even with what's going on in the world right now, with this coronavirus crap, it's still three-day shipping. 2020 convention exclusive. Okay, now let's see how much this... P-I-C-C-O-L-O-7-60. This is going for $23. So we got this one, $23. This one, if only it was the actual convention exclusive, that thing's going for 42 But once again, mystery box after mystery box, nothing but anime pops. And I do not collect anime pops. So if you guys want these, they will be in my Poshmark, along with the Goku eating noodles. I have a bunch, a bunch of stuff on my Poshmark. And I post stuff all the time from mystery boxes that I don't collect and stuff like that. So, if you would like to see more videos like this video, make sure you hit the subscribe button below. Like this video and comment what is the crappiest, crappiest pull you've ever received from a mystery box any mr box any pop any anything what is the worst pull you have ever pulled let me know i will see you guys in the next video peace